We just came and picked oh, up yeah. our oh, shrimp yeah. that Terry's giving us. Some twilist uh, ghosties, baby. Hold on, baby. Hey, roll. Push up on that side. On the boat. Here. I got it. Daniel and his son and Terry went it to Bodega Bay and pumped some shrimp for us. All right, good yeah. luck, guys. All right, good luck. Catch Keep in back, touch. January 29th, we're out here with Lou. Yeah. Hopefully, hopefully he catches his first sturgeon. We're fishing a little cut this morning. We just got here. It's 10 o'clock. Outgoing tide. No. Maybe a small uh, sturgeon. It's a, it's a, that, that, oh yeah, you're doing that. It's a light hard. Or an undersized. Let me get that. All right. Oh, the hose hooked up to something. Um, no, that's actually, it looks like a sturgeon. Got it up? Yeah. Hold on. I can't even get the damn net. Yeah, let's find this one. Oh, the nice Nice ice cream. Oh, you're nice one. Drink them up a little bit. Let me just release the. I think your other one's getting hit too. No. Oh, sorry. Oh, yeah. Look at this, guys. Beautiful striper. Definitely. What? 20, 26? 28? Looks like a 26. Twenty six inch striper, beautiful striper. Yes. Yeah, it's starting to slow down out there, huh, John? There's about fourteen boats here right now. Is it? Is the water? Is the water starting to slow down though? To turn? Oh yeah, it's it's slowing down, but there's a lot of crap in the water. Oh. There's a lot of tules and stuff like that in the water here. Yeah, we still got uh, we're still fishing in thirty feet of water over here. You're in thirty. Okay, we're in eighteen here. Yeah. Well, that's this charter got three, three out of the, two out of the three are keepers. Uh huh. Yeah, they're right in front of us. You can see them on the stringer. So. Did he come in after you or what? Yep. Yeah, right. anchored down right after us. I didn't even uh -huh. realize it until we started hearing them. It's that dragon. Uh huh. That uh -huh. dragon one, that charter. We didn't even realize he was there until he they started yelling hookup, and then they really? said, yeah, one of them was a double hookup. Oh jeez. Yeah. You guys gonna stay there for a while? Oh yeah, until it, it turns around. This is a good spot right here. Nice. Stripers are healthy too. 26 inch. Mm -hmm. No, really. No, I think you crossed mine. Oh, I crossed your line? Well, it's one o'clock. We're gonna go ahead and go fish the shallows. We were fishing little cut on the incoming tide. Boat in front of us caught two sturgeons. The boat behind us caught one. We didn't get lucky, so we're just gonna go ahead and uh, go to the shallows. <laughs>
Well, it's 130. We haven't caught nothing on the shallows, but we're about to cook. I brought some oysters. Uh, put some fresh oysters on fresh the grill. Fresh oysters on the grill. And then you squeeze some lemon in a big jar like this. And then you add you add this under lemon pepper marinated mix into the jar and it gives them a good flavor. So then you pour that in there, the whole bag. Just put the whole bag in there? Yep. All right, and here we are making the mixture. There you go. Now cover it and shake it. Right here. And the best way to do it is using a mason jar so you can cover it up and make sure it doesn't leak and mix it all together. There you go. And this is this all lemon juice or is it lemon and orange? No, it's all lemon juice. Now you put them on the grill. Do you need to cover them? Let them cook a little bit. They open on their own. You could uh, make the best out of a tin can, aluminum can from. There's, that's good right there. So that's my half. And drink. And go ahead and grab your half. Pour it all. So this has got to warm up. Once, once these things open. We'll put it, we'll dip them in this uh, can. We put the cans on the grill and it's actually like a soup. It's gonna be real good. Double quick, huh? It's gonna boil it. All right, so here it goes right here. We cut it right here. Once they're cooked, you pour them in there like that. Here's another one. go so as they cook they start opening up as they cook they start opening up yep all right let's see i see how you got it going and you're, you're actually uh warming up the uh the broth there huh? and you put another one there the marinade. That's three for me all right we got them here they're in there they're just warming up they're gonna taste good so you definitely got to make it, let it get hot, huh? It's nice and steamy. The flavor, you don't see the flavor, it's real good. Look at that bad boy steam, nice uh, oyster meat. Fully cooked, as you can see. Mmm. Pretty good, huh? Yes, the marinade and the lemon. And that makes it phenomenal. That makes it a good seafood little appetizer here. All right, guys. Well, we haven't caught nothing to, yet, but we're still trying. So we're going to go ahead and enjoy these oysters. We have to come back. Definitely. Really good. Well, it's 4 o'clock. It's been pretty quiet out here. We're going to go ahead and fish till about five. Hopefully it changes. Hopefully we catch something. But it was a beautiful day out here again. Nice and hot. Water temperature is 52. There he goes. Got him. Right. Good concentration. You stayed on it. He might not be a keeper, but he's a yeah, yeah, baby. Little baby. Ooh, 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 ooh. <laughs> Yeah. 
the pros and cons of fishing. Undersized striper slaps. Look at this baby. <laughs> hey, you're not skunked. Well, it's 5.30. We're calling it a day. It was kind of slow out here today for sturgeon. We didn't catch no sturgeon, no baby or any kind of type of sturgeon. We caught a nice 26 inch striper. And we didn't really see a lot of boats catch fish. We only, uh, that charter that was in front of us, he caught two sturgeon. And the guy behind us, he caught one sturgeon. But I think I don't think it was a keeper because he released it. It was a beautiful day out here. We had good oysters. And we're good. Right, Lou? Yeah. We'll try again. All right. That's why it's called fish.